Hello friends, welcome to Cinema Cap YouTube channel, today we are going to see Alchemy of Souls Season 1 Episode 14 The Final Fight, before entering into the topic, please subscribe the channel for more videos, Episode 14 of Alchemy of Souls starts with Jang UK facing his toughest challenge yet, Seo Yo. Before that spicy duel though, Jin Mu quizzes the crown prince over UK's skills. The prince conversationally reveals that UK always has his maid by his side. As far as he's concerned, UK isn't being taught spells by anyone. But could that be enough for Jin Mu to suspect her? UK is someone who could bring chaos to the world if his power is not kept under control, and that's something Park Jin is concerned by. However, for now we see UK's incredible power and talent has allowed him to learn Chizu and catch the fabled golden fish, just as Hempley said, now, the circumstances around Cha Biam stepping down stem from the crown prince himself. He's dead set on whoever UK's opponent is, they must defeat him. With RHE pressure so high, the mage steps aside and decides to let Yul get involved, especially with the prize of Mudiak on the line, Yul is well positioned to benefit from this, and having given the crown prince his word, we catch up to the moments from last episode, Yul and Jang UK square off, with UK much improved after mastering the Chizu technique. The duel goes back and forth. With goosebump inducing orchestral music in the background. Honestly, it's like a boss fight in a Final Fantasy game at this point, anyway, instead of a world-ending summon spell, Yul knocks down Jang UK and watches as he flies across the floor. Although he loses, mastering Chizu has dwarfed the achievement of winning the duel. At least for now anyway. Of course, this also means that Mudiak now serves Yul, rather than Jang UK, with Jang UK recovering, Yom is delighted to see the level that the young student has managed to achieve. At the same time, Mudiak learns the terms for Yol's duel. Although she's serving him now, she's still allowed to visit Jang UK at any time. Not only that, but Yol also has her promise to help him when the time comes for him to leave for Siaho Fortress, meanwhile, the love triangle with Park Jean, Hemp Master Lee and Maidservant Kim continues, as Park Jean realizes exactly who is trying to win the woman over, Park Jean is shocked, and has to hold on to the chair when Jang UK hopes that Kim marries a loving man. He's also going to root for Lee and Kim to get together. Which certainly shocks Park Jean. The latter soon suces out the shoes and realizes that Lee and Kim have been meeting for quite a while now. He must have been the one who gave her the wildflowers too, he says sadly, and walks away, Jang UK and Dangu arrive to see Mudiak, concerned that she may not be getting along okay with her new master. Looking up though, he notices Mudiak and Yul together, with the latter brandishing a new bird whistle. He watches with despair as the two bond, meanwhile, King Go soon decides to invite Hemp Master Lee to his chambers, intending to ease his worries about whether there's a soul shifter nearby, speaking of nearby, over at Jinyuan. Jean Ho Jiang remains dead set on finding her long lost daughter. But despite so many people showing up, Cho Yun is starting to lose faith. Unfortunately, Cho Yun lets her guard down outside and she ends up pricked by Jean Wu Tak, who clearly has a nefarious scheme in mind. Park Jean continues to grow suspicious of Mudiak Ad in the end, tasks Sang Ho with looking into her background. Given the details around Jang UK meeting Mudiak are hazy, he wants to get to the bottom of this once and for all. However, they're not the only ones on the hunt. It turns out several loan sharks are on the hunt for Soai too, given the debt she owes. But as we know, she's with Jin Mu at Chanbaguan and she watches, in horror, as the two women she conned from the boat are brought out dot and fed to a soul shifter in hiding, as the bodies petrify and turn black, Jin Mu uses this as a lesson to keep her in line and get rid of anyone who may recognize Soai, in the wake of this, there's some pretty funny drama involving Mudiak and the crown prince. Earlier in the episode, he challenges Mudiak's dedication to UK and throws the jade stone in a pool outside. She keeps a poker face until later on when she fishes it out in the middle of the night. When Mudiak rejoins the crown prince here, the pair verbally spar over the importance of this stone. In the end, Mudiak keeps hold of it and refuses to give it back, just then, a couple of mages arrive and start to berate her. 
the crown prince offers up a trinket that will stop anyone from badmouthing her before she leaves. Noticing ink on one of the men's shoulders, he gives him some advice about using white rice to get rid of it. That is, of course, a throwback to the Sungrim exam, anyway, after a touch of jealousy, Jang Yu Ke throws Mudiak completely off guard and kisses her, deciding to go for the pretty woman after all. Mudiak ends up running off after, but she does show the jade stone to him. Seemingly solidifying their feelings for one another, Mudiak soon runs into Park Jean though, who questions her history, including lying about being blind. She manages to hold her own in the face of strong questioning, with Mudiak's guardian standing by her side. He encourages Mudiak to head by the ferry inn. Before he goes, he mentions Soai arriving, which throws Mudiak off her game. Mudiak thinks this over when she shows up at Ferry Inn, where she finds a man on the floor with his throat slit. Unfortunately, Park Jean appears just after and immediately believes she's the one responsible. Meanwhile, Master Li Chiol arrives before Go Soon, accompanied by Yeol, Dangu, and Jang Yu Ke, where he tells them all he can recognize soul shifters. And he's the shifter. Jang Yu Ke realizes, with horror, that he knew Mudiak was a shifter from the very beginning, that's the end, hope I you love this video, for more videos. Please subscribe the channel, signing off from Cinema Cap. That's the end, thanks for watching the full video, hope you love this video. Please press the like button and give your comments about this video, and we'll upload videos regularly so don't forget to subscribe our channel, give your suggestion about next topic in comments section, meet you in next video, bye bye.